Hey everyone, today we are talking about digestive enzymes. So, digestive enzyme supplements have gained popularity for the claims of treating um, common gut irritation, heartburn, and other ailments. But how do digestive enzymes work? and who actually need them. Now, naturally occurring digestive enzymes are proteins that are made by your body that help to break down food and aid in digestion. Your stomach, your small intestine, and your pancreas are where most of the digestive enzymes are produced, but your pancreas is actually known as the, the um, powerhouse of digestion because that is where most and the most important digestive enzymes are produced. So they help to break down carbohydrates, proteins, and fats and some of the, the big digestive enzymes that you've probably heard of include amylase. Now, amylase is made within the mouth, but also in the pancreas, and this helps to break down co complex carbohydrates. Next, we have lipase, which is only made by the pancreas. This helps to break down lipids or fats. And then the last one is protease that is also made in the pancreas. And as you could have guessed, it uh, breaks down proteins. Now, some other enzymes that are made in the small intestines are lactase, which breaks down lactose. A lot of people are deficient in lactase and therefore can have um, lactose intolerance. And then the next one is sucrose, which helps to break down sucrose. Now, some people don't have enough digestive enzymes, and this is known as digestive enzyme insufficiency. So either their bodies don't release the enzymes as they should, or they don't make enough. And this means that they can't digest certain foods, and therefore they can't absorb the nutrients sufficiently. Digestive, digestive enzyme insufficiency can lead to malnutrition and gastrointestinal um, irritation. And some of the, the common symptoms that you can expect are things like pain and cramping, um, lots of gas or belching, diarrhea, um, oily stools. You can actually physically see the fat in the stools or unexplained weight loss. Overall, a healthy person would not need to take digestive enzymes and we don't want to give unnecessary supplements. Generally, our goal is to have you on as little as possible extra medication and we want your body to, to work properly and do everything itself and I want you actually to get all the minerals and um, vitamins and everything that you need rather from your diet instead of supplementing it. <clears throat> Excuse me. So the best digestive enzymes are the ones that your body makes naturally and they work best when you eat a whole food diet. If you need digestive enzymes, um, so, so if for instance you have any of the symptoms that I mentioned previously, what we can start off with is testing either your pancreas via blood tests or we can test elastase in your stool. All right, so we can do a blood test or we can do a stool test Obviously, or we can do both. Um, and the goal is then to find the underlying cause. I don't just want to give you a digestive enzyme to use for the rest of your life. The digestive enzymes are actually just a band-aid for the symptoms. And we need to find what is causing either the lack of making enough digestive enzymes or why it's not being released into the digestive tract. So we do not urge anyone to take digestive enzymes unnecessarily and if it does mean that you do need digestive enzymes we would love to work with you and help to figure out what the cause may be.